One of the biggest changes that came with Apple's newest update was that emojis were capable of changing skin tones. And some have said that it's racist, but not everyone is convinced. Latasha Clay updated her phone just a few days ago, and that's when she noticed that she could change the skin tone on most of her emojis. It put a huge smile on my face. They were the same as me. I was so stoked, so I went through and changed all of my emojis to save time. Changing them is simple. You just hold down the icon and a selection of skin tones will pop up above. You can choose from there. With all of my friends, they laughed when they saw it. They really liked it because they knew it was me. Some have complained that you are identifying your race immediately in a text. They've asked the questions, if I'm black, do I have to use only brown skinned emojis? However, Latasha says that this proves how the world is becoming more accepting of diversity. It's already started and everyone out there has their own voice and are changing the world, so I think it's a really good thing. Many deaf people will use text messaging to communicate, even on a professional level. But Latasha says that skin-toned emojis won't affect those conversations. Even if it were someone who was deaf, if it's professional, I still wouldn't use emojis. None of them. I'd only use them with my friends. Along with the multiple skin tones, Apple added emojis of same-sex couples and an additional 300 new icons. Oh.